Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks. And several weeks ago, I made a video on blending a banner. And a viewer or subscriber sent me a tip and asked me why I didn't use the gradient tool. But it's really under the interactive field tool. And then you get a menu bar with the fountain fields. And you can change your colors to whatever colors you want. Of course, us being laser engravers. You can do things like that. You can adjust the, the blend, basically. And you can even rotate the blend a little bit differently than before. You could probably actually move it down a little bit and blend it quite differently. And then what I would do to do what I did here is left-click, no outline. Take the object, Control-D, make a duplicate, and then mirror it this way. And grab that node right there and put it on that node and you have a completely different blend that is kind of a, a unique pattern you could even go one step more control D holding down the control button till you get that two-sided arrow look at that that is pretty cool now we've we've got a line between them so what we could do is put our nudge factor on 0 0.001 grab that bottom and just nudge it up ever so lightly getting a red of that line even there's a little bit of a line there you could that way your blend that is a cool effect so i think that viewer or subscriber for uh, giving me that tip i hope that helped a little bit thank you for watching